everyone, what's up? It's Mike Deary from Rock Guitar Power, and I'm shooting this video in my brand new recording studio. So I'm really excited. I'm going to take you guys for a real quick tour and show you all the stuff I've been working on for a long time now. But the studio's finally done. I had my first uh, drum session uh, earlier to break in the studio, and it's sounding freaking awesome. I'm loving it. Um, so, um, yeah, let me give you a quick tour. So, I'm on the tripod here, so we'll s scroll around. So, this is in my basement, which was pretty dank, nasty in a typical basement, but after months of working my butt off, um, it's looking pretty sweet. So, here's the main room, which is the tracking room, the mixing room, and everything. And here's the drum kit. We got a Yamaha um, stage custom set. So I put all the Oralex up on the walls, so the sound environment here is nice and even. And if we come around, we got a vocal booth here. And all these uh, walls you're seeing, I actually made out of cubicle dividers, like office partitions. I found somebody on Craigslist bought a whole bunch of them for dirt cheap and made walls out of them, and they work awesome. So I got to bring some more guitars down, but here's the setup right now. And I got some cool mood lighting when, uh, when it's time to get in the mood. And so here's the really other cool thing. So I built these ISO cabinets for my amp. So if I pop this open, hang on, it's probably jerking around all over the place. You can see that I got my guitar amp in here. And in this one is the computer and all the other stuff that makes noise with fans and all that stuff. And I got my pedal board and a bunch of other cool stuff. So, one of the really cool things I'm excited about is uh, being able to work with bands now and do some really other cool projects for recording and things for rock guitar power. So definitely I'll be keeping you in touch with that. But uh, I did a drum session earlier with my buddy Ryan Barclay. He's in a band called The Moho Collective. You should definitely check him out. He's one of the best drummers I know. Um, you can learn more about them by going to themohocollective.com. But uh, he was by a little bit earlier. We uh, did a drum session and a jamming session to, to get everything mic'd. And uh, so I'll splice that video at the end of this so you can see it and check it out. But uh, really excited. Got a lot of cool things in the works. So um, yeah, I hope you like seeing the studio. And uh, I'll be sure to keep you in touch with the new things I come out with down here. And, uh, and that's about it. Mike Deary, Rock Guitar Power. We'll see you soon. You not record it? No. <laughs> we'll do it all once more. Okay. That, somewhere like in between, I think. Like that last thing was At like... The there? Because you weren't hearing, hearing enough accents of my riff. Yeah, I know. it. Just a little bit less than that and it'd be perfect. Okay. So um, where it, I'll call it the gallop. Where it kind of okay. gallops, but try to put the snare in on the hits. Yeah, here's like, the like. Uh, Perfect. Yeah. Because cool. now like that, it brings that riff out. All right. Do you want that at the end or in both sections? Let's do it. Do it a lot after the the B part. Okay. You know, so do it like once going into the B part. Okay, so you, but you want to keep it, do you want to keep it like, um, kind of keep it the way you've been doing it, but use it at towards the tail end of that section to yeah. to boost it up, but do it more the second time. Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah, and we'll just keep doing it more at, at the end. Oh, okay, so all right, so more than four. Yeah, all just right. keep, like, ride it out and just see what happens. I like it. I like it a lot. So...